So today I'm going to be showing you on how to fix a problem I had, which was when I try to install something, for example, Unity, it would start installing and once I clicked on it, it would say install aborted. And I went to YouTube to fix this. There was nothing on YouTube that helped, no tutorials. So then I asked my cousin and he helped me fix this. So and I thought this would help uh you guys if you have this issue, so I'm uploading this. So once I go to this, it says opening Unity, I click yes. I agree. Install. It says install aborted. So the reason for that could be because when you guys go to, for example, wherever the location of the download is, if if you have installed this before, this could be the problem. And for example, you want to delete it, then you just go to, then you just select the file from here. And what you do is you just drag it into the recycle clip or recycle bin, or you right click and delete this. That deletes these files, but it doesn't delete the other files in the system, which messes it up. And so it's having trouble, like, re so it's trying to read the other fi files, but most of them are deleted, so that's why it can't install it. So a quick fix for this is, you guys go to your start, go to start, and then scroll down to where it says, Windows system, click on control panel, click on uninstall a program, and then once this loads up, you should see Unity here. And this is not the thing I want to uninstall because this is just the version. So now you guys should see Unity Hub over here. And I'll just open that up by mistake. So now you want to go to Unity Hub and uninstall that. You can either right click and uninst uninstall, or you can just double click on this and click uninstall. And if it says that, just click OK. It should uninstall. And once this has uninstalled, what you want to do is you want to exit out. And then you can either go to the website and install the file again or the install setup. You guys already have that. So you guys need to go to your downloads. And you guys should have this Unity Hub setup. You double click on this. Yes. I agree. Whatever location you want to install this to. Then click install. And now this should just install normal normally and you can either check this or uncheck this it that's just your personal preference click finish and now if you check that it should just open and this might come up because you got this from the internet and it has a lot of tutorials so what you you guys want to do is click allow access if it's unity or if it's something else, make sure you trust it. And now, as you can see, and if you already had the version for this, but because you deleted it, it's not showing up here. What you can do is you can just double click on the version. And then it will just load up in here. And then just close the close that window. It will just load up. And yeah, that's basically it for today's video. If that helped you guys, please comment down below and like this video. And I'll see you in the next one.